Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to use Edit GPT to edit a Word document while maintaining styles and track changes. Okay, so let's start with our Word document. We have a recommendation letter here. Uh, I will copy it and carry it over to editgpt.app. I'll jump to the dashboard, create a new document. This will open up the editor. Once we're in the editor, we can paste our text. Now, up the top, you have proofreading functions. Now the default functions start with grammar and they go all the way up to rewrite. So the further you go along the top bar, the more intensive the editing is. So one of my personal favorites is a custom one that I made. So you can write your own custom prompts. It's fix only awkward parts. So let's select our text, click fix only awkward parts. And what this does is it maintains your voice and it only focuses on areas that were poorly phrased. This is great for ESL speakers. If English isn't your first language, I recommend this prompt. It really just focuses on the poorly written parts. Okay, once we've done that, we can select areas we don't like, accept, reject. I'm gonna keep everything as is because I wanna maintain this formatting and copy it over to Word. So what I can do is hit the copy button, jump over to Word, hit paste, and it's messed up my formatting, so I will click Match Destination Formatting. And what this has done, if we click here, it has kept the track changes there. So this is great if you're an editor, if you want to keep those track changes there, if you're working with other people. Excellent tool. I use it all the time. So Edit GPT, it's free uh, for users up to 10,000 words. And if you get a pro account now, it is only $10 a month, and you get 300,000 words which I'm sure you will not use all of. So check it out, edit GPT.